The conventional part-time four-wheel drive vehicle, being driven in two-wheel drive, supplies power from the engine to the rear wheels from the rear drive shaft. The rear differential allows each wheel to receive differing amounts of torque based on driving conditions. When driving in a straight line on hard bitumen, both wheels receive 50% of total torque. When turning, the outside wheel must travel a longer path, which means that the torque required between wheels must be different to allow the outside wheel to turn at a faster rate. Once the front hubs are locked and four-wheel drive engaged, the front and rear drive shafts are connected together through the transfer case and become one rigid link. Torque is now distributed to all four wheels based on the driving conditions. When travelling off-road, the differential can work against us as it supplies all available power to the wheel with the least amount of traction or resistance. If a rear wheel lifts off the ground or loses traction, we will not get bogged as long as both front wheels maintain traction. The problem arises when we lose traction on any one front wheel and any one rear wheel at the same time because all torque will be sent to the two spinning wheels. During the practical driving, it becomes important that we maintain an even amount of traction and weight distribution on all four wheels to allow traversing rough terrain.